Yeah, so uh, the um, the lightsaber ones, there's been loads of lightsaber videos, and I've been wanting to find one where it shows us like the lightsaber slice in half. And thanks to our good friend, who I've done a few videos on now, he's actually made one of these, and I can't wait to see it. It look the the snippet tool, the snippet, the thumbnail looks brilliant. So I can't wait to see what uh, what this looks like. So about a week ago, I was making some ideas. God, I wish you'd slowed that down because I would have actually enjoyed reading that. So yes, uh, Vic Tech Industries. This guy is awesome at making lightsabers. Hello there. Hello there. Shorter than I expected. Oh, I don't think so. I have the high ground. You underestimate my power. Do it. <laughs> Ironic. What about the joint attack on the Wookiees? Oh, look Let's at go, that. Guys. Hope you're all having a great day. I can't wait to see build this. We're going to be making a lightsaber cutaway from the Star Wars Visual Dictionary. I've wanted to do this project for a while now, but I didn't want to cut a perfectly good saber in half. So I ended up making the saber well, yeah. from scratch. I'm going to be starting off with this aluminium tube. We're just going to simply machine both sides to bring them down to diameter. I see through the lies of the Jedi. Yeah, the thing is, if you've got a perfectly good saber and cut it in half, first it'd be a nightmare trying to cut it in half. And also, it wouldn't have the internals in that you're going for, so... Ah, so he's doing clever. So, Anakin's hill. I'm sorry, Skywalker's hill. Ah, I get I also get a mix of oh, After machining, I simply cut it in half with a hacksaw. This was actually much easier than I originally thought it would be. Uh -huh. This is getting out of hand. Now there are two of them. Hey, that's the exact same um, belt sander that I had. Oh, now that we sad. have half a saber, we can start to add the Graflex details. Starting by adding the holes where some brass pins will go. Wait a minute, how did this happen? We're smarter than this. I wish I'd done this now. Yeah, it's too late. It's too Since late. I've I got all have my a stuff bunch of spare saber parts. I'll be using them to finish the outside gone. of the hill. Is that legal? I will make it. I might be able to rewire a plug, but that's pretty much all I can do now. Now that we have all our parts, we'll use some five minute epoxy to attach the end cap. Is a uh, Vic Tech Industries. It looks more like Wayland Industries uh, logo. So you have to make everything and cut everything in half. Gutting. He made a gorgeous uh, Skywalker hill. Uh, it's on the channel. I, I did cover it on the uh, on here in the build for it, but it was so nice. Now we have all our parts. We'll start to assemble. Put on the control box, followed by one of the buttons. Then we'll put on one of the bunny ears along bunny with the ears. emitter. We're making sure that we epoxy everything as we go along. Now that we've got those parts in place, it's going to be a we'll ball ache to try and get everything to fit perfectly in line and not grips, fall out. Then we'll put on the cover tech knob. Well, glue, I suppose. Once we've done that, that'll be one half of the saber done.
thing is he's got to build all the guts inside and that's what I'm looking forward to. To be honest, I bet it will take to do this hilt will take so much more time than a normal hilt. I put a replica Graflex clamp on, ESB card, and a D-ring on the saber. Okay. It'll um, it'll, it'll take so much longer to do this I don't like because sand. of all the tiny little details and all the little parts he's gonna have to make. Rough and irritated, and it gets everywhere. I then went into my junk drawer to look for some electronics, got some junk parts, picked the ones that I thought looked the best, and then started to assemble. I then Sorry. began gluing LEDs, resistors, and capacitors to little circuit boards to best replicate what was seen in the Visual Dictionary. The, uh, the picture from the Visual Dictionary, the one that he's replicating, uh, I actually had a version of that right when I first started doing lightsabers on my now thing. Now that I've got all the little circuit boards, I'll start to epoxy everything in place. That looks cool. Next, I will start epoxying in some small black acrylic circles that I cut on the bandsaw. These are to separate the saber into three different sections, also to hold okay. things in place. I then cut some reflective tape to be placed inside the crystal chamber. That's what they used uh, on the actual lightsaber blades when doing the original films. Next is the power cell insulation. I will be using some clay to sculpt this bit by hand. Really? All right, okay. Right. So uncivilized. Will the clay go off? After I've finished sculpting, I will carefully remove it and place it inside a little container. I will then mix in some silicon oh. so then I can make a mold. Nice, I like you. Nice. That looks cool. Yeah, I used to do molds and that sort of thing. The next part to be done is some field energizers. These are being machined out of some 12 millimeter brass. Now that the energizers are finished being machined, we will now epoxy them in place as well. Don't let some meal be one. Now that I've got the energizers in place, I can begin to add wires cool. and other small details to finish off the electronics portion of the saber. See, I, I, I just adding those little tiny amounts of why I just makes just adds it, just gives it a bit more crystal. This is outrageous. I love the mom. Do you ever hear the tragedy of Darth Plagueis? <clears throat> Story the Jedi would tell you. I think that might be a proper crystal, actually. Sure, but a welcome one. 
Let's take a shine. And here oh. it is, the finished saber. If you enjoyed today's video, please leave a like and remember to subscribe if you haven't already. You can also leave a comment about really something cool. you would like to see made in future builds. Have a good one. I'm just a simple man trying to make my way in the universe. You are on this council, but we do not grant you the rank of master. That was cool. Uh, I love the uh, the detailing on there. I always, I kind of always wanted something like that, but I just never built one. I never did it in the end. But that was cool. That was really good. Yeah, you like the power pack? Yeah, the power pack looked really, really good. Oh, to be able to make things again. I still, sadly, I still don't have any desire to make anything. I'm, I think we're going to just appreciate what other people can do more. Uh, I wish I could have collabed with this guy. Just this guy come over or me go to his and just have a couple of days just playing around and just making stuff. It would have been awesome, man. It would have been great. He's got mad skills. I say this every time I watch one of his videos. Every time I watch one of his videos, uh, I also say he's got absolutely crazy skills. And he has. He does. I mean, that would be worth a lot. I mean, if you were to buy that, how much would you pay for that? I think I'd easily pay 150 quid. I'm cheap. 250 yeah anyone else well, how much would you any of you ever play 175 305 okay so it's worth a fair bit then I'm surprised he's not sold maybe he does sell these things i don't know who knows